Just a quick update. I've uh, I bought a battery for this. My plan, this seat base, I don't know if you can see it. Hang on a minute. Let's get a, let's get a torch out. This seat base is absolutely rusted to hell. Um, so, I mean, I think if I take the cover off, there's going to be nothing to attach the cover to. <laughs> um, anyway, the other thing is I thought I would just, I'd just turn it, turn it by hand and see, but it is absolutely seized. So then I thought I'll put some oil down the bores and of course, boom, that's happened. So yeah, it just absolutely turned to, turned to mush. So that's not great. I shall shove it in the hole for now. But this engine is locked solid. <laughs> it is locked solid. And uh, yeah, I've had a little spray around while I was, this got sprayed with oil. I was hoping it might work its way in and you know, but no, it's just seized solid and the plugs, I haven't even tried the other side. Because I reckon the other side's going to do the same thing at the moment. So, anyway, that'll do for today. I wasn't going to spend time on this today, really, except I sort of was curious, but uh, I kind of wish I hadn't done anything, um, really. <laughs> Getting that plug out is going to be a royal pain in the arse. Look at that. Oh, dear. That is absolutely welded in there. Such a shame, this bike has only got 16,000 miles on the clock. And uh, it was just parked and left and no oil down the bores, no, no nothing, just basically parked and left. And this is what you come back to 30 years later. And it looks like it was not particularly dry where it was stored either so I don't know we'll see what happens we'll see how far we want to go with this yeah anyway there we go that's today